The old manager, Gisco Monos, has gone. We've got a new guy. Fish kill him. World class. You are top of my list of hotels, you bunch of legends. Look at this. Right, match is kicking off in an hour and a half time. Hello everybody, I'm Ben Foster, the Cycling GK. Welcome back to the Match Day Vlogs, the international break. Boof, done, finito, goodbye. Premier League football is back and we've got a tough old game tomorrow. Liverpool at home, 12.30 kickoff at Bickeridge Road. It's gonna be a tough match, isn't it? Come on, we know that. It's Liverpool, it's the Premier League. Every game is gonna be tough. You just bring your A game, give it 110%, that's all you can do. There's been a bit of change here at Vicarage Road. The old manager, Gisco Monos, has gone. We've got a new guy in charge. You might know him as the Tinker Man. More recently, winning the league with Leicester, Claudio Ranieri. This guy has got some kind of aura about him. Honestly, he just demands respect. When he speaks, you just shut up and listen. The guy is going to be hopefully a bit of a legend for us. He's only been here a week, but I like him already. I really, really do. Right, got a bit of training today. Then we're to the hotel as normal, and then wake up tomorrow, early kickoff, Liverpool FC. Before we do all that though, yes, you little beauty. I'm getting on this bike. I'm gonna have a nice little chill Zwift session. Look at this. There you go. Boom. Get me on there. Get me ready for training. Let's go. Come on, the boys. It's good to be back. Woo. There we go, half hour done on the bike. The main man, Graham Stack, just came, kept me entertained. There you go, how are you doing, Led? You all right? Very good, very good. God, is this Love man, this Stacky, the best goalie coach in the freaking Premier League, aren't you, mate? <laughs> I don't know about that. Yes, you are, mate, you're the man. Right, love you, Stack, all right, boom. I need to go get showered, get me some Breco. Come on, let's go. Right, it's 10 o'clock, breakfast is closed. I've missed breakfast, I'm fuming, so, cup of tea. Little bit of pool with, where is he? There, Rob Elliott. I beat him every time, he's rubbish at pool, honestly. An absolute doddle, I told you. Scummy, scummy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right, we're just going out for training. I just want to do a big old shout out to there's a little boy who is my son's friend, little Charlie. He's just had a massive, massive operation on his spine. A brave little boy to correct it, to get it straight. Guys, get yourself down in the comments. Give him some serious love because he needs it. He loves the channel, he watches, and he's gonna be reading your lovely comments, okay? So Charlie, get well soon, mate. When you're back fit, I can't wait to be back in the goal, saving some shot from you as usual, you little superstar. Charlie, all the best, mate. Wow, Vincenzo, no respect for the GoPro. Wow. Oh, world class. Did you see that save? That's on the GoPro. Yes. What a goalie. Did you see that save from Rob Elliott? What a goalkeeper. Oh my gosh. Lovely training session that. Come on, boys. Okay, training's all finished. We've got some of the young lads here in the gym, okay? I've got my boy Josh here. This is his Instagram profile there. Just go follow him. He's a lovely, lovely bloke. However, right, I've just said to him, if he was in a nightclub right now, right, and the music came on, like his favourite song, and it was pumping, he was having a lovely time, right? What would his go-to dance be? What would his dance be? So this is it, guys. This is what Josh has got for us all. Come on. We've got to give you some <laughs> right there we go training all finished i will see you lovely lot at the hotel later on see you later girls Bye. 
They are mad for it. Come on, the boys. Right, we're at the hotel. It's a different hotel to what we're used to because the normal hotel, the NFL is in town and they have booked out the whole complete hotel. So we're staying at a different one, but it's bloody lovely. Have a look at this dining room. World class. That is a big lot of space in it. I'll show you my bedroom in a minute. Time to get some dindins though, come on. Dindins. Here we go, we're getting into the room. Usual pudding, let's have a look at this bad boy. Oh, it's dark. Let's see what we got. Oh, this looks very snazzy. Look at this bad boy. I will take that all day long. Look at that beautiful bed. Right guys, I will see you all in the morning and it's an early start. Liverpool at Vicarage Road, 12.30 kickoff. Yes sir. Right guys, I was just about to settle in for the night and chill down, right? And I've looked over to the side where like the tea and kettle is and stuff like this. Look what the hotel have put in my room for me. This is outrageous. Boom. They put some tomato ketchup in my room. How good is this? And there's a little note. I haven't even read the note yet. It says, oh my gosh, look at this. Up the Fozcast. Hi Ben, welcome to the Village Hotel in Elstree, Watford. Good luck to you and the team in your game tomorrow. We thought you would like your own bottle of ketchup with dinner later. Enjoy from everybody at the Village Hotel Elstree. That is incredible. Oh, you bunch of legends. Village Hotel Elstree, world class. You are top of my list of hotels, you bunch of legends. Look at this. Right, good morning everybody from a really, really wet village hotel in Elm Street, which is about, it's about 15, 20 minutes away from the stadium. Yeah, it is nailing it down with rain. The things I do for you guys, I'm getting soaked already. Anyway, go and get a bit of breakfast in a minute and then it's team meeting on the coach as usual to the game. It's the early kickoff. It's going to be a weird breakfast as usual. I'm still buzzing about my tomato ketchup though from last night. Honestly, means a lot that. Thank you. Am I easily impressed or is it just really nice? Either way, I'm buzzing. Thank you. Come on, let's go get some Breco. Oh, this is horrible. Right, just about to go and get my Breco, but first. Oh. How good's that? There you go. Oh. Right, here we go, meeting done. It's half past 10 in the morning, just about to get on the coach. See big Basler, it's nailing it down still. Basler, how long? Oh, about 20 minutes today. Cheers, guys. Morning, guys. Quite a legend, come on. Oh, wow, that's lovely. Cheers, lads. Hey, Hello. Hi. Hello, you good. okay? Good, how are you? I'm good, thanks, you? <laughs> Hi, guys, you okay? Done. Hello, mate. Hello, mate. Nice to see you, right? Thank you, mate, you're good. Hello. You okay? All right, lads. Nice to see you. Boss, you okay? You're all right? Yes, Rash, you okay? All right, lads. Right, match is kicking off in an hour and a half time. Scott, he didn't plan for this rain. It's supposed to be sunny today, but pitch is looking belting, mate, isn't it? It's forecast. It's all right, it's all right. It's all right. Yeah. It'll look nice on the telly, mate. Don't you bloody worry about it. Okay, Rhino Legs here, back with a bit of fan cam. Got my son, George, with me today. Hi. So, first and foremost, Georgie, What's the score going to be? 3-1 Watford. 3-1, love it. Brilliant. I'm going 3-0. Ishmael Asar to bag a couple. Love it. Let's grab some fans and see what's what. Hey, what are you thinking the score for Watford Liverpool today? 2-1 uh, Watford. 2-1 Watford. Love that. Who's, who's going to score the goals today? Saw and Fernandez. Love it. OK, well, enjoy the game. Okay. Catch you later. Thank you. Okay. Right, just found Mason, who is a big cycling GK fan. Is that right, Mason? Yes. Okay, tell us what is going to happen in the game today. 2-1, Watford win. Saw goal. I reckon Femenia assist. Okay. Van Dyke might score a header, though. Brilliant. Okay, well, it sounds like it's going to be a Watford win, because yeah. all the fans are saying that. <laughs> okay, enjoy the game. So the game's finished. It was 5-0 to Liverpool in the end. Uh, a really disappointing result. I've got to give credit to Liverpool though. They were really, really good today. Absolute top class. I think when you get to see it up close and personal, how good these teams are, um, you can see the level. And they were firing on all cylinders today. Mo Salah was incredible. Mane, Rapid, Firmino, um, Trent Alexander. Everybody was absolutely popping today. It's just a little bit disappointing we conceded. 
the early goal, I think the early goal really kind of took the wind out of our sails. If we could have held on for 25, 30 minutes, then maybe we would have got a foothold in the game. But that's football, guys. The level is so, so high. Like I say, fair play to Liverpool. They were absolutely top class today. Not the end of the world, though. Another big game next Saturday against Everton. We need to bounce back. We've got to keep going, keep smiling. That's football for you, all right? It's tough. You're going to get these results sometimes. It's all the way it goes, all right? I've got a giveaway for you guys. Have a look at this. We got Kelleher's shirt from today's game. If you guys want to stand a chance of winning this for sure, get yourself down in the comments below. Give Charlie, the little man I told you about earlier who's had the spinal surgery, give him your best wishes. I know for a fact he will be buzzing off every single one of them and we'll pick the winner for the best comment from that. All the best guys, I'll see you all soon. See you later.